What's going on everyone? Back again with another unboxing video. Uh, we got two special boxes today I want to run through uh, with you. Let's start, start this off with uh, opening up another Hoyo I got to add to my collection. And again, I removed the labels from boxes. Um, opened the cardboard box. I even cut, took scissors and cut the tape off the bubble wrap to make this a little easier and a little quicker for you guys. So I'm going to shorten up the videos a little bit or try to. Again, just like before from our um, unboxing Cubans. These are from June 2022. It's the Hoyo, uh, it's the Siri La Hoyo, uh, and this one is the Rico, Rio Seco, I'm sorry. Um, again, I have a couple of these in the humidor already. Really great Cuban cigar. But wanted to add a, this box, especially having some age on it, wanted to add it to the collection. Uh, I've enjoyed this one so much. There we go. Again, this is a larger 56 ring gauge Vitola. See if we can get this out of there without causing any damage to any of them. This is a box of 10 versus the box of, uh, of 25 that you normally see. The La Jolla line. I'm glad they do the box of 10s because, again, I have such a large cigar collection that. A box of 25 really starts to add up to a lot of cigars and takes up a lot of space in the humidor. So I appreciate the boxes of 10. They work out perfectly for me. And aging and smoking and keeping kind of the rotation going. I and mean, I don't get to smoke a ton. Probably get in four, maybe five cigars per week. This is our second unboxing of the day. Again, already cut everything open to make this one easier to, to do with you guys. Remove the label, cut, cut all the tape. So you guys don't have to sit and watch me fumble through this is another very special uh, cigar. This is the uh, Diplomaticos, uh, and it's called the uh, Collection Privada II, um, better known as the Regional Edition for Spain. Uh, there was only, there was 50,000 boxes made of this Matola as the Spain region on this is box number 7,996. And this box is from July, 2022. So these were made pretty close to each other. And a little small Vita pack in there. And then this comes with the Thick cedar sleeve. It's got the Diplomaticos logo pressed into it. You got your certificate of authenticity. You got the dogs in the background making noise. And again, like all the regionals, come with uh, this leaflet talking about you know what the 
Talking about the, the Vitola, the name, it's a 52 ring gauge by 135 millimeter uh, D Largo. And I don't, again, all this is written in, in Spanish and I can't read it to you, but feel free to pause the video and read it if you're able to. Got more protective bubble wrap in there for the feet. This is actually another regional that I've never tried. So looking forward to giving this one a shot. Again, it's the Diplomaticos Exclusivo España. Uh, smell amazing, got that rustic wrapper like the majority of the uh, Diplomaticos do. You know, I've had the Caribbean, Canada, of course, the Cuba, and they all taste, smell, and look amazing. But the one thing I appreciate the most about these type of velvety, rustic wrappers on these cigars is uh, I, I believe they age extremely well. Um, and it's similar to, and I know I brought it up in the last video, but similar to the uh, the Monte Cristo wided windows. That wrapper leaf they use, I feel like, ages very, very well. Adds a lot of complexity and flavor to the to the cigar. Uh oh, but anyways, again, didn't want to take up a, a, a huge amount of time, but wanted to share these two with you guys. These already have uh, quite a bit of age on them, so I plan to give them a, a try here uh, pretty rapidly, especially with the Diplomaticos. I think I still have three or four uh, Rio Secos in my humidor that I have to smoke through before I get to these. So um, these will get to settle a little longer and rest a little longer than these. But again, I'll put, I'm on, I plan to put both in the humidor and uh, as soon as this video is over and let them sit for, I don't know, three weeks, a month before I dig in the box and make sure they're completely acclim acclimated to the humidity in, in uh, this region of the world. They've come a long ways to get here, so I uh, definitely don't want to rush anything and, and waste an experience. But thank you guys so much for being with me again today. Remember that every day is a uh, special occasion, so... Enjoy it. You guys have a great one.